Hi, this is Melanie for the Pardaisy Channel. I had a request to do a reaction to this trailer called Evening Shadows. This is a film about a son coming out to his mother and the mother and son relationship. It's set in South India. It's play it's been doing the rounds of film festivals. So it I think it played at the Bengaluru Film Festival in India and maybe some other film festivals there. It's played in, you know, Europe. It's been playing some just this month, I think there was like, because it's been Pride Month here in uh, the States this summer. There was um, some LGBTQ film festivals that it played in in various cities. But I don't think it's had... A commercial release or been bought by either Netflix or Amazon Prime for me to see which may be the only way that I can see it I don't know that'll be coming to uh, theater in my neighborhood but anyway okay I want to watch this trailer and then let's talk about it go <laughs> वसु वो आ रहा है ना वरना उसके अपने घर के पूजा में मेहमान उससे पहले यहाँ होंगे ये सब क्या है मुझे नहीं करनी कोई शादी वादी पूजा के लिए आए हो ना बस नीला तुम्हें पसंद है ये सुनो नो करेक्ट टाइम पर शादी मतलब करेक्ट टाइम पर बच्चा बाप जब तक रिटायर होने के लिए तैयार है बच्चा को जॉब मिल जाता है वो फैमिली का रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटीज उठाने के लिए तैयार है इतना सिंपल कैलकुलेशन समझ में नहीं आता है तुम्हें अभी तो छोटा है ये बस इस बारे में मुझे कोई बात नहीं सुननी है दक्षिण में देने वाला शौल का अंदर होगा यहाँ क्यों नहीं है भाग्य में जो लिखा होता है ना उसे कोई बदल नहीं सकता हम अपना भाग्य खुद लिखते हैं अम्मा तुम्हें कुछ बताना है तुम्हारा सीक्रेट हम गे मुझे लड़कियों में कोई इंटरेस्ट ही नहीं मैं एक लड़के से प्यार करता हूँ अमन से तो जवाब देना आसान था मेरे लिए वाह इवन द ट्रेलर इज पावरफुल आई थिंक कमिंग आउट is can be universally hard although here in the united states fortunately like in my lifetime i have seen it change from being this cataclysmic thing to tell your family to one of my 17 year old sons um good friends <laughs> high school senior just came on in twitter with like a crazy video and and I had known for years that this kid was probably gay and just, and his parents literally didn't care. They would support him, whatever. And then he just felt that freedom to just be himself. You know, I just thought it was so awesome. I was just thinking the difference from when I was in high school that was many years ago. And, you know, my best friend at the time telling me and just how nervous he was about it. I mean, of course, I was very supportive, but just the difference, you know, here in the United States. 
Now, obviously, that's not with every family because there are still very religious families, fundamentalist families who reject their children who are gay or transgendered or whatever it might be. And they don't have that support. And a lot of homeless kids in the United States are because, from families like that who have rejected them. And then they become homeless because they don't have anywhere to go. So I'm not saying it's not still a problem, you know, or that they're, but I feel like it's getting better here in the United States. But it's important. I just remember how important films were and television was in changing people's minds here in the United States and just making it become a non-issue and making gay marriage just a normal thing. And that was really through the power of films and television. Um, someone like Tom Hanks winning the Oscar for playing an AIDS patient. Um, you know, films like... or. TV shows like Will and Grace and Modern Family showing uh, gay people and then Modern Family showing a gay marriage and how they have just the same quirky problems as the other crazy people in the families. Film and art and television can really change hearts and minds. And that's why it's so important for there to be films like this to show the Indian community what these issues are and explore some of these issues. I thought, you know, Kapoor and Sons was maybe the first film that I saw where a gay person, it wasn't like a dust down or something. It wasn't where a gay relationship was a joke. It was something serious and showed a son grappling with living a lie and finally telling his parents and I thought Fawad Khan's performance was amazing. But I I was like, how could how could his family be so blind? You know what I mean? And it was like a willful blindness. And I see that at the beginning of this trailer. Like the son is trying to push off, but doesn't know at first doesn't know how to tell his parents, No, I don't want to get married to a girl. Like, you know, I'm living this other life. So films like this are so important. I hope I get a chance to see the full film. It looks amazing. I'm glad that it's getting such a good reception doing the film festival circuit. I know about doing that. Sometimes they do, films do that for a while. Maybe it will become something I can rent on iTunes or uh, hopefully Netflix or Amazon Prime will pick it up because I think this would be perfect for one of those services. But if any of you do see this up here, on a streaming service, please do let me know because this is a film that I'm interested in and that I want to see. It looks really good. Anyway, thank you for the person who sent this to me through Facebook. Please do, if you have other trailers that you want me to watch, send them to my Twitter or to the Facebook page uh, for Pardaisy and subscribe to the Pardaisy channel. Then if you hit the bell, you get a notification whenever I have a new trailer reaction or film review.